Welcome to Entertainment Daily with OK. All right, so basketball coach in a middle school is accused of doing the unthinkable. Let's get into the story. But before we do, please, parents, keep your eyes on your children, please. All right, as reported by the Neighborhood Talk, it says a man who volunteered as an assistant basketball coach at a middle school in Detroit is accused of doing the unthinkable. According to the report, the Von Devon Gray filmed himself having sex with a middle school girl that is 12 years old earlier this year when he was 19 years old. Police didn't disclose what the middle uh what middle school is involved in this case. According to the affidavit, Devon approached the 12 years old girl back in January while she was waiting to uh, to be picked up from cheerleading practice. He reportedly told the girl he was 15 years old and she told him she was 12 years old. He then hit the middle school girl on Instagram and Snapchat and then told her he liked her. The compliment reads, then on January 10th or January 11th, Devon allegedly asked the girl to come over to his house. When she got to his home, he continually asked her to do it. The, hmm, the complaint said he and the girl had sex, which, wow, hmm, with Devon recorded on his cell phone, authorities claim. The video, was the video was discovered by another student after the 12-year-old girl let the student use her phone. Dan saw several videos and images of the 12-year-old girl having sex with an adult man after the phone was returned. They took a screenshot and shared it on Instagram. It, hmm. A few students said it looked like a Devon and someone told a teacher, who then reported it to the police. A search warrant was carried out and they found similar videos in Devon's phone. Devon is accused of producing child pornography and distributing and possession of child pornography. If convicted, he faced up to 30 years in prison for producing child pornography, up to 20 years for distribution, and up to 20 years for possessing it. So th there's just so many questions here, okay? I had to take it slow by like like slowly so everybody gets to understand what we are discussing and what this involves. In the first place, how is it that a little child of 12 years old have so much freedom okay all those kids they have their phones they have these but don't parents kind of tap into their children's phone just to see what's going on like from time to time and i mean tapping i mean check the kids phone take their phone if you want to pretend like you want to make a call you want to do something just check their phone so you make sure if this child's parent were checking her phone they would have seen when that message came in you look good you this inviting her over to his home and whatnot that's when they would have stopped it but because people are not paying so much attention and the people just feel like oh once you're 12 you're 13 you're 14 you can do whatever you want because at that age they start throwing tantrums and acting as if they know it all this is just messy and the fact that this young girl of 12 years old keeps something like that in her phone i'm not sure what she was thinking i'm not sure why she even left something like that or why did she even allow him to record okay let's even say that he was 15 years old even if he was 15 and she was 12 or uh he was 13 and she was 12 why do you keep such a thing in your phone are you not afraid that your mom or your dad or one of your siblings are going to stumble across something like that and you're going to get in trouble these days kids are no longer afraid of nothing and the world is just going to to hell like why would a 19 years old even think of getting down with a 12 years old you have your fellow 19 years old 20 years old and all of that but this guy chose a 12 years old and she told him earlier on even before he invited her over parents watch your kids <laughs>